it's Monday morning and the start of my day I'm going to stick on the slow cooker um, so that today's going to be a really busy day I'm going to go out and do my haul and um, I've got lots of things to post so the last thing I'm going to feel like doing is cooking dinner tonight so I've got the slow cooker here ready to go and I'm going to make honey mustard silver side so I'm just going to show you how I do it okay so this is a really really simple recipe and you can see i've already prepped my potatoes and carrots here so um, they're just peeled and halved and i've got my um, silver side and a jar of honey mustard sauce and literally that is all you need so i'm just gonna um put the potatoes and the carrots inside the slow cooker first and the silver side and the sauce on top hold on Okay, so as you can see here, I've just literally um, put a little bit of um, non-stick spray in there, put the potatoes and the carrots on the bottom, and I have sat the silver side on top. And there we go, so that's it. Honey mustard sauce on top of the silver side, carrots and potatoes. So literally when I come home tonight, I've got some um, broccoli that I'll um, steam in the microwave and dinner will be done so quick, so easy. So this takes eight um, hours on low on the slow cooker and literally that's all you have to do and it is delicious. I'll show you the finished product later tonight. See ya. Hey guys. Okay, I've just arrived at my first shop. Had my coffee and yeah, I'm here. So first haul of the day. I'm hoping to get through three stores today and um, then I'll head home, I think. But yeah, let's see how fast I can do this this morning. Okay, just came out of store one and it's nearly 11 o'clock. So I've been in there for about an hour and a half. Probably spent about $90, I think it was. And um, yeah, I got quite a lot of stuff. But um, I'm keen to get over to the next store because I'm conscious that I do have a lot of packing and stuff to do as well. So, yep, I'm off. Okay, back from store two. Not great in there today. It's normally one of my um, honey holes, if you call it, where I normally get quite a bit of stuff, but um, not a huge much, um, not a huge amount today. A few things, a cool, couple of cool pairs of shoes, and um, I'm in and out pretty quickly. So it's 12 o'clock and I am racing to the next one, but I do need a toilet stop. And I am getting hungry, so I'll be looking around for some um, food. See ya! So, I've just stopped to have lunch because I'm starving. Oh my god, I'm so hungry. And um, look, I've got some rice noodles here with um, sweet chili sauce and vegetables. So I've tried to pick the healthiest um, takeaway that I can while I'm out. <laughs> I would have liked sushi, but I can't I can't find a sushi store. So anyway, rice noodles is much better than McDonald's or KFC or anything like that. And I love rice noodles. I don't know about you, but they're my favorite. Um, but oh my God, I just took all my might not to order the little spring rolls <laughs> that they sell in there because I love spring rolls. I like, I love spring rolls. Who like, yum. And um, they sell them and they're so good and I'm like, I didn't order the spring rolls, so yay me. Um, Cause yeah, I am on a diet and well, diet, mm, don't know. I definitely need to lose a little bit of weight. I am, I'm not massive, but you know, like I've put on some weight while I've been on meds and I just feel a bit bleh. So anyway, um, sorry, shouldn't eat what? I'm talking. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna scoff this down, um, or at least half of it, so I can get into the next shop because there's two more stores that I want to do before um, the afternoon. I'm conscious. I've got to get home and pack up all my orders. Oh, I'm running out of time. Can I see? Hi guys, okay, so I've just done another two stores, but I didn't spend very long in that second store because I totally stuffed my bloody back. Oh, I don't know what I was doing. I was just leaning in on one of the racks and I just must have been awkward how I had my arm because it was a skinny rack and there's people in it. Next minute I could just feel it like cramping all up. So 
yeah, I don't know what I've done. I've just, literally, I just had it in the wrong position and it's um, right side chicken wing at the back and oh God, feels like bloody torture. I don't know what I've done to it, but I, um, I clearly need to rub some um, deep heat or something into it and get some neurofin in me. That's killing. So anyway, I need to stretch that out. So anyway, it's two o'clock now. I'm done for the day with that freaking back. That's um. Anyway, I'm um. I'm sure it could be worse, but anyway, it does hurt, and I'm gonna go home now, pack on my orders, and I'm hoping my husband might be able to pick the kids up from school today, so that's one less um drive I have to do, and I can just go home, pack the pack the orders, or finish packing them because I have packed about half and get in the car to the post office and then I can show you what I got. See ya. Hey guys. Okay, so posting's done for the day and I've just bought all my haul from today inside to the house. I've chucked it on the bed here and I'm gonna try and show you what I've bought today. It's a little bit hard because I'm here on my own. Um, so anyway, I'll do the best that I can. So I'm just gonna turn the camera around and show you what I got. Okay, so this is everything that I picked up today. So yeah, I did pretty well. I've scored quite a lot of stuff. So down here, um, you'll see I've got a couple of pairs of Melissa shoes. And Melissa, I don't know if they're like a Chinese, Japanese kind of brand I don't know they might not be but they kind of have that Japanese anime kind of look to them but anyway they're like a rubber kind of shoe and they're very expensive so they sell very well like I would think I haven't run comps I know Melissa's shoes um, sell well but those ones with the little red love hearts oh, I think I'll be looking at um, 15 bucks ah uh, sorry 50 bucks at least for those but um, yeah we will see Anyway, I've got a couple of um, books here. As you can see, I got a few Bibles today, which was which was lucky. Um, I got the old Humphrey B. Bear. Do you remember Humphrey? Oh my God, he was my favourite. I absolutely loved Humphrey. So paid five dollars for the old Humphrey B. Bear, and I found this Mario stuffed toy, and he was two dollars. So that was pretty good. Oh, now how am I going to show you all this? Let me see. Won't show you at all because it's just too much. But anyway, what have we got here? This is like some kind of um, soft shell um, racing jacket. Okay, so where are we? We've got some kind of um, motorcycle men's shirt here. It's very booner and ugly, but um, choppers. We'll see how that goes. Um, just a little dress that was on sale for $2. Oh, this is going to be hard to show you, so hold on a second. Um, some um, fox racing men's jeans. Um, these little denim shorts. I think I'm going to give these to my daughter. They're super cute. And um, yeah, just little plain. They're like brand new almost. Uh, this was a good one. This is a um, Roxy women's puffer jacket anyway it's literally like brand new so seven dollars i paid for that so i was happy with that what do we got here um just some shorts um yeah country road yellows were two dollars today so country road there i'm not sure what this brand is it was new with tags and um yellow so it was two dollars um, it is a just a business kind of like um, skirt, pin straight skirt, um, and it's 100% wool. So 
hopefully that one will go okay. Um, most of these clothes, they're not um, big ticket items, they're just kind of bread and butter, but um, you know, I sell a lot of that, so it doesn't bother me. This is a little Tokyo dress, Tokito, Tokito, whatever it's called, $2.00. Picked up a lot of dresses today for $2 just because that's what they had there. I guess coming into summer, they're bringing out a lot of the summer stock. $2 for a little Elwood dress. Um, $2 for Boohoo dress. Um, this was a cute dress. Again, $2. The brand is Coast. Never heard of it, but um, just a really nice summer dress. Pair of these jeans here. What are these? I don't even know what this brand is. Core denim. I don't know what that is. I don't even know why I picked that up. Anyway, <laughs> must be a reason there somewhere. Um, another cute little um, dress for two dollars. Summer's coming, and I'm selling, starting to um, sell quite a bit of summer wear. That's a really nice little Q skirt. Um, red was half price. So $3.50 for the Q skirt. Um, I think this is just a long sleeve. Um, Rip Curl Rashi long sleeve. Half price, $1.75. Um, cute skirt here for $2 on the yellow. Can't remember. I think it's Mossimo. Yeah, it's Mossimo. Um, what's this with a tag? Oh, I think this is only like a um, Kmart or Big W kind of. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I think it's only like Kmart, Big W. It's brand new with tags. It's a plus size top, like size 22 or something. Um, and, you know, it's on the $2 rack. But it's new with tags. And, you know, obviously it's not going to make a huge amount of money a top like that but it's such an easy sell as long as it's priced right you don't have to make a big you know huge amount of money on every item as long as you you know make some profit if it's something that you know is going to flip quick I'd, I'm happy to see it go um these were Hugo Boss jeans um they're really nice look pretty good um, I think this is just another little dress for $2. Um, which is the brand? It's on sale for 2 on the yellow tag. I can't see the brand there. It's something. Okay, what's this? $2 rack again. God love the $2 racks. Um, pretty little things. Size 8. Fake black leather skirt. Um, these are popular. Anything fake leather seems to do well for me. Um, okay, plus sized um, stripy skirt, straight skirt. I love the plus size stuff, it sells well for me. Little pair of Quicksilver, um, size 30 or 32 they were, men's shorts. Um, this jacket was half price and it's the ASOS brand. And yeah, it's just a, um, like a trench. Coat. so it's in excellent condition everything's with it so for two bucks I wasn't going to knock it back uh, what's this brand okay this is a dress the brand is Moschino and that was on the half price so three dollars fifty um, this is a cute little black dress um, slideshow, so, or sideshow, whatever, slideshow, yep, $2, um, long sleeve, little black dress, very cute. Mm. Pair of women's Speedos, um, half price, no marks in the girly bit areas, which you must check with swimmers. Um, and to be honest, you know, I don't really like picking up secondhand swimmers or with the bras and stuff. I'll only pick them up if they're brand new with tags. Swimmers, I will pick them up. Um, Speedos seem to do quite well. For $2.50, I wasn't going to say no to them. They're expensive Speedo swimmers. So people who don't care about that kind of thing, not for me personally, but <laughs> you 
Anyway, here's a cute little dress on the $2 rack, Quirky Circus. I've sold that brand before. This is another $2 rack, Piper is the brand. I just really like the colours of this for summer. Um, anyway, you can't really see it, but it is a little summer dress. Um, what have we got here? Rod and Gun shirt, I think this is. Yep, Rod and Gun on the $2 rack. Thank you. Now, this should be Land's End, I think. Half price, $2.50. Um, it's quite an expensive brand. These are an unusual pair of three-quarter pants, but I thought they were quite cute. Um, so we'll see how they go. This is another swimmer top. Stussy. It's pretty cute. No marks again. Always checking for marks in the breast area and the lady bits area for swimmers. Um, this little Portman's jacket, just a little business one, cropped, size 14, $2. Can't go wrong. Okay, now these shorts here were the North Face, and they were $5 each, but there was two pairs of them, and they're exactly the same size. They've obviously come from, same shorts, same size. They've obviously come from the same person, so I bought the two of them because I'm going to lock them up as a... Um, I don't normally lock things up, but um, yeah, I'm, go I'm definitely going to lock those two up, I think. Um, oh, what was this? I don't know. Lululemon. Um, this was a maternity, maternity dress on the $2 rack, and it's been dry cleaned. So, yeah, just a simple black maternity dress, which somebody will want. Oh, this was pretty funky. Forgot about this. I did pay up for this nine bucks. So, can you see it? It's actually a little women's G Star um, vest. Yep, and all the tags are properly on it. So, yeah, it's pretty cute. It's just, um, it's different. I haven't seen anything like it before. So, um, yeah, I think that'll, even though I paid nine bucks, I think that'll go all right. I think this is a little Veronica Main skirt. Half price on the red. Veronica Main plus sized at 16, so bonus. It's a nice summer skirt. A couple of men's shirts here. I think I might actually give these ones to my son. Um... I think this is just a cotton on one or something but these were just on the two dollar rack so um there's a burgundy one and a white one same same size same brand no doubt come from the same person for two dollars each they're my son's size so i think i'm just going to give those two to him um this was just a cute little bardo top nice and bright for summer 250 i picked up a um like a um, large adult size um, wetsuit vest. So I paid $8 for that. Um, and yeah, I might even give that one a go first on the Facebook marketplace. Um, but yeah, oh, we have these for my kids for when we go water skiing. And I don't know what this brand is, Ripple. It's probably not a very expensive brand, but it's, you know, it's not the typical surf brand, but they are expensive, so took that these were cute they were just new in the bag still and they had one on display and they're actually from pottery barn and they're like for babies like 12 to 18 months and they're like little towels um with the little hood so yeah super cute they were two dollars um they had more but i just wasn't really sure how well they would sell um but yeah they were cute maybe i should have bought the rest of them but See, and this is probably one of my funniest. Oh, this was just another cute little dress, summer dress in a plus size. Now, get a load of this. Hold on, I'm just going to light out. Okay, what do you reckon? Duff man. <laughs> I thought this was so cool. It's like, seriously, it's the coolest costume. I'm like, do we keep this? This is like, could go in my collection. I'm like love fancy dress i have this i have a mad collection of fancy dress um for myself um and 
Personally, this is not one that I would wear, but it's certainly one that my husband or my son would wear. So it's definitely, definitely quite funny. Guys, thanks so much if you followed along with me today. I'm pretty happy with the, the hauls that I got from the few stores that I went to. My back is feeling better. Thank God. Oh my God. I don't know. I must have like pinched a nerve or something. It just, yeah, bloody it hurt. But anyway, that's feeling better. I've got a cold beer because um, I deserve it after today. It's been massive, massive day. Anyway, so heaps of big haul. Managed to get all my posting run done. Um, the slow cooker's on. Oh my God, it smells amazing. And um, I will um, take a photo of it all, plate it up and add it to um, this film. But yeah, anyway, I've had a really good day and um, yeah, tomorrow's gonna be busy. Lots of photographing, lots of listing. Cheers.